my channel. So this week is one of my absolute favorite weeks ever because it is Ipsy week and I just love doing Ipsy every month because makeup, hello. So I had every intention today of filming this video where there's better lighting and more natural light and all that jazz. And then the weather decided that it was going to get really stinking cold again and that just ain't happening. So here I am because being warm is better. So first off, we're going to start with last month's bag. We'll see what I thought of all of this stuff. And honestly guys, like I loved last month's bag so much, it's insane. Our first thing here is this Tucker Ashley Advanced Peptide Eye Complex. And as you can see, look at the bottle. I like used it all in a month. I used it morning and night and it was amazing. I felt like it actually helped tighten everything around my eyes really well. So that was a win. Our next thing is this Promise Organic Ultra Moisturizing Argan Cream Facial Lotion with Olive Oil. And again, you can see that I used it all. This stuff was awesome. It left my face feeling very soft and just smooth and it was great. I loved it. Next we have this Marsk Your Toast Mineral Eyeshadow. And there's the color. And this stuff is awesome. It applies so well and there's very little fallout from it, if any at all. I like to use this with other browns and stuff just to have that little bit of a shimmer right in the middle of my eyes. And it was like perfect. Like you put it on and it's staying in there. And that's great. There's nothing more irritating than trying to wipe eyeshadow off of your face without it just like making giant color streaks across your cheeks, right? Next up, I have this Mr. Right Now eyeliner, and this is in the color Jacques. It's this pretty golden brown color that I showed you guys last time, and I love this color. It is just so pretty and so simple, and it is absolutely perfect if you're doing like a more neutral, natural type of look, and it's just it applies really well and it doesn't smudge it's just awesome I love that brand Thumbs up. last thing is this dirty little secret lipstick in the color vengeance and if you guys keep up with my Instagram whatsoever you will know that I tried out this color this month and absolutely loved it it's so beautiful like, it's so wearable where you might not expect it to be easily worn, but I love it. It's beautiful. And it stays on all day, and it's just fantastic. So this bag, overall, was just an absolute win. I loved it so much. Perfect. Which means this month's bag is going to have to kind of battle it out try to win some brownie points here. So first off, I like to do the little card first. And this month's theme was Pretty in Ipsy Pink. It says this February we're taking our favorite shade from dainty to daring with rule breaking looks for all beauty lovers. And the bag, let's start with the back. We'll start with the back because it's, it's, you know, it's cute because it's pink. But then the front, this is where my nerdy side comes out just a little bit. Look at this, it's a little 8-bit envelope. That is the cutest stinking thing I've ever seen. Oh my god, I'm in love with this bag, just right off the bat, in love with this bag. All right, jumping in here. First thing I pulled out is Perfectly Posh Look Natural Best Face Forever. Exfoliating Daily Face Wash. This has got peppermint, grapefruit oil, and aloe vera in it. A nourishing base holds millions of exfoliating microbeads. Aren't those bad? I thought microbeads were bad. Yeesh. 
Um, it's gentle enough for every day with a naturally cleansing blend of essential oils. Wash with a pea-sized dollop in warm water as part of your daily face routine. So I will be giving this a try, just because I always like to try out the products that come in my Ipsy bag so that I can review them properly. But yeah, I thought that microbeads were like a, a bad thing now. That they found out they were like really bad for the environment or something. I don't know. Leave me a comment below if you know something about that more than I do because I'm just kind of going off what I've heard. Um, my next product is the Mary Luminizer. It's just this cute little travel size, sample size. And I'm actually really, really excited to try this because first off, yet again, it's from the Balm. And as I have said in past videos, I love their products, so I'm always really excited to get their stuff in my Ipsy bags. But I've also seen a lot of stuff about this in other people's videos where a lot of people have used it, and I've never tried it. So I'm really excited to get to try this one because different powdered things and whatnot make me nervous, you know? I don't do a whole lot of like deep contouring, I don't do bright highlights, I don't do crazy blushes, but it's not because I'm against them, I'm just scared. <laughs> I don't really know what I'm doing, so I just like, I don't know. I play with it and try, but I'm scared. It's okay, it's okay. That's what Ipsy's for. My next thing is a lip gloss, it looks like, from Vantage by Jessica Leedskin. I'm sure I'm completely butchering that name and I am sorry but it is just a very very shiny lip gloss that I can't get open how do I open it okay it's in the color pink sequin I found it on the bottom it's just hard to read because it's very light and this is very pink all oh, right oh god okay so first off it's got like this brush and I don't think I've ever seen lip gloss or anything like this come with a brush. That's interesting. And it's just very, very, very sparkly. You guys see it right there? It's not like, boom, pink, when it's you apply it to your skin. I mean, it's still pink, but it's like a baby pink. But it's very sparkly. Oh my gosh. Whew. I think I've said before that I'm not like a super lip gloss type person. At least I know that I've mentioned it on Instagram. So we'll see how that goes because I have a feeling this has the potential to be kind of sticky. All right, my next thing is this Paula Dorf Enhancer Baby Eyes. So I'm guessing this is one of those products that you kind of like put on your uh, bottom like waterline and it's supposed to like make your eyes look bigger or something I don't know it's just like a peachy type of pink color so I'm gonna guess that's what that's for either that or maybe it's just regular eyeliner I don't know we'll figure it out we'll figure it out the upside to Ipsy is that if you don't really know what something is for you can always go to the website and click on the product under your glam bag stuff and it'll generally help you figure out what it's for or what it can be for or, you know, just more information in general, which is awesome. Last thing, which I am so excited about, these are my all-time favorite things to get in Ipsy bags, guys. All-time favorite. And this one is pink, and I think you pronounce it Luxie. That's how it looks to me. It's a 231 small tapered blending brush, and it is so pretty. Ah, uh, just look, it's pink, and it's so soft. I'm so excited, so excited. Like, honestly, if I had an Ipsy bag that was just all brushes, I don't even think I'd be mad, because I'd be so excited that one month I got like five different types of brushes. That would be amazing. They should make that a theme one of these months, just do like, all brushes. Contouring and highlighting and blush and whatever else you might need. All brushes. That'd be awesome. 
So anyway, that is all that was in my Ipsy bag for this month. I'm really excited to try all of these products because it's some stuff that I've never really tried before. Like I said, lip gloss I'm always a little iffy on. Um, the highlight I'm really looking forward to because I've wanted to try it for a while. Um, I've never tried a eyeliner in that light of a shade, so I'm really looking forward to that. And I always like to try out new face washes, so there's something. And then the brush, of course, the brush is like top notch. So that is everything that I got in my Etsy bag this month. I will give it all a try and let you guys know next month what I thought of all of it. So make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you are not subscribed already. And if you are not subscribed to Ipsy yet, it is a monthly subscription service that is $10 a month and you get five sample size items and a really cute makeup bag every month delivered straight to your door. So if you are not subscribed to Ipsy yet and you want to be, I will leave a link down below for you guys to go sign up. If you are subscribed to Ipsy, leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you got in your Ipsy bag and what you thought of it. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!